we are going nuts today. We ask a very important question, can we lower the risk of a heart attack with food and in particular with nuts? Can we prevent a heart attack? Can we prevent myocardial infarction? So what do nuts have? What do nuts do? How much nuts do you need to have a health benefit? And at the end of the video, I'll give you a bonus of five rules uh, to optimize uh, the health effects of nuts when you act shop for nuts at two hours and three use. And we are all aware of the importance of the whole diet path and the whole uh, package. However, I believe it will be beneficial to uh, concentrate a bit on some specific foods because they are so healthy. That's why we're looking at nuts. Uh, as you know, heart disease continues to be our number one killer. It has been number one killer since 1918, the year of the Spanish flu. Preliminary data from 2021 showed almost 700,000 Americans died from heart disease, 600,000 died from cancer, 515,000 died of uh, COVID, and COVID took the first spot ahead of strokes and unintentional injuries. And of this cardiac death, more than half are sudden and sudden death, although sometimes may have some warning signs. I actually made a video on uh, this, I'll put the link. Uh, many times sudden cardiac death is the first and the last uh, uh, symptom. And 80% of people who die of heart disease die from coronary disease blockage in the pipes that supply blood to the heart. So nuts are heart friendly. And let's look at some data. Here's a study in the Journal of Internal Medicine. Nuts are anti heterogenic meaning they fight uh, buildup of plaques in your, uh, in your arteries. Another study, nuts consumption in the physician health study on the archives of internal medicine. And it was not just the physician's health study, as is shown here on the Journal of Nutrition. The Nurses Health Study, the Adventist Health Study, the Iowa Women Health Study all showed a decreased mortality in coronary artery disease and heart attacks and myocardial infarction. So what's going on with nuts? What do they have? They are so beneficial. Well, they are rich in plant protein like peanuts, uh, pistachios, uh, almonds. They have 26 uh, and 20 and 21 grams per hundred grams. If you look at walnuts and uh, cashews, uh, 15 grams and uh, 18 grams. If you look at pecans and uh, macadamia nuts, they have 9 and 8 uh, grams. But besides proteins, what else do nuts have? They are actually rich in uh, fiber, up to uh, between 4 to 11 grams per hundred grams. They are uh, rich in fats, but very little saturated fats. They are rich in healthy fats. For instance, walnuts have uh, linoleic acid and alpha-linolenic acid. Actually, that omega-3 fatty acid, the same acid you're going to find in the fatty fish. They are rich in vitamins A, B, C, E, and folate. And they are very rich in uh, minerals, uh, sodium, potassium, iron, uh, magnesium, uh, selenium. And they are rich in phytochemicals like phytosterols that compounds they actually lower your cholesterol, incorporating some margarines like uh, Benacol and uh, other. And uh, let's take a look at Brazilian nuts. It's a very interesting study done in volunteers, and they uh, gave them four Brazilian nuts, just about 20 grams, less than one, one ounce. And they uh, drew blood at every three hours and then 24 two days, five days, and 30 days. And they look at the good cholesterol, the HDL, and the bad cholesterol, the LDL, and triglycerides. And after nine hours, after the only single dose of the Brazilian nuts, the LDL cholesterol came down and the good cholesterol came up and persisted up to 30 days with one single dose. In fact, pretty impressive. What uh, do uh, nuts do? In addition to lowering your uh, cholesterol, your triglycerides, increasing the good cholesterol, they lower your blood pressure, they reduce the inflammation, they improve endothelial function, the arterial wall, 
uh, function that decreases the risk of blood clots, which could lead to less heart attacks than the strokes. They lower cardiac uh, mortality, mainly due to the lowering uh, sudden cardiac death. And the question is, uh, how much nuts? On the physician half study, was two or more servings uh, a week. On the Adventist half study, the nurse half study, they looked at five or more servings a week. On the Iowa women's half study, they look at two to four uh, servings a week. But even the physician half study, two or more servings of nuts a week lower the risk of sudden cardiac death by about 47%. Uh, so what type of nuts? All nuts are good, walnuts and almonds are the most studied, peanuts are good and all the others. Uh, here's the bonus, and I, I promise you my five rules to optimize the health benefits of nuts when you go shopping. The two R's and three U's. First of all, buy raw or dry roasted. You don't want to add extra fat to the nuts. They are already rich in fats, but good fats. And you want to buy unsalted, unsweetened, and unpeeled. So you don't want to have anything that added uh, sh sugar, just empty calories, or salt. Otherwise, it counteract beneficial effects of nuts lowering your blood pressure. And you want to buy, if at all possible, unpeeled, because on the outer pellicle, is actually very rich and in antioxidants. So, uh, so in conclusion, heart disease continues to be our number one killer. Uh, most than, uh, more than half of these deaths are in fact uh, 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 sudden. And although it's important to address the classical risk factors, the high blood pressure, the smoking, the diabetes, the high cholesterol, it's all important, but it's not enough. There are four major studies that showed that uh, nuts decrease the mortality in coronary artery disease and sudden cardiac death. And uh, so have a handful of nuts two to five times a week. Nuts are great snacks. Let's all go nuts. Here's some further resources on my website, my email. And remember, uh, your health is too important to be delegated to others. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel, write your comments, ask questions. I publish these videos on the second and fourth Friday of each month. Let's all go nuts. See you next video.